Baba Booey. If you enjoyed this video and you want to see more, make sure to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. We post new episodes every week, and we'd hate for you to miss one. Boo! Riff comes. Extra spooky style. Just how we like them. In December. In these parts. Whoa! <laughs> it might be snowing wherever you are watching this. Not Doubt sure. it is here. Mm. Anyway... No, I actually heard it might be snowing tonight in uh, New York. We're dating this. We're filming this on Halloween. But anyway. If y'all can hear this and see this, send us your snowy pictures. Send us your snow in a specially marked envelope. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What? Oh. Mm -hmm. I thought you were going to be doing a fucking stick stickly P.O. box. No. Do you remember it? Uh -huh. Yes, I do, but I'm not doing it. Thank you. We don't need it anymore. I was going to reference snow. Well, you did reference no. Yeah. So anyway, from that same... Al Snow. <laughs> from that same time period, we're heading back to the early 90s for a Nickelodeon original. And I haven't told Dylan yet, so he doesn't know what this is. I Why is it Doug remember. Bags of Nematode? No, it's a live action show. And we've talked about... The possibility of doing this for a while, but I feel like if we're scraping the bottom of the Halloween barrel, this is bound to come up. Not a Halloween special per se, but it's just spooky enough to pass. It is episode two. Absolute your shorts. shorts. Yeah, Zeke the plumber. Zeke the goddamn plumber. Oh, we had already watched this before. Nope. Like this Blair Witch ass because intro. Because it's big and gray. This path that I'm walking Thanks, on is called the dirt path. Sponge giving us the rundown for the tape he's going to send home to his parents who don't give a fuck and aren't going to watch it anyway. The sacred trees. Hey, get that camera off me. What are you doing? I'm carving ugly as a loser into the tree. Get the camera off me as I explain exactly what, what I'm, I'm doing. doing. Everyone has that haircut these days. Yeah, it's, it's back in style. I, I have that haircut, almost. Everyone's got that hat. Bum, 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 bum. Wonder if this is Pinsky or Michael era. Well, it's season one, oh, yeah, so, so it's Michael. Michael. Yeah. yeah, Pinsky doesn't show up till season two. Oh, it's Michael. <laughs> oh, it's Michael. Infinitely less charisma than Pinsky <laughs> ever did. Because Pinsky was kind of like a troublemaker. Mike is just there. Mike is our. I don't know what the name for the trope is, but the the character in the show who basically is the audience. Oh, like, yeah. we can relate to the him. The everyman. Yeah, because he just came to the camp. Everyone else already knows each other. So he's kind of the odd man the out. The everyman. The thing came apart. We gotta wanna watch me! Gotta, I used to watch this show, like, religiously. Me too. I used to all the time watch Sponge open up the bag and take out the magical shoes. Did y'all ever, ever go to camps? No. no! My sister did, and I was like, just thought it sounded so shitty. I thought the concept of, like, making friends and stuff sounded awesome, and, like, maybe being in nature, but being, like, camping kind of mm. stuff? No, no. No. I think we talked about this before, but summer camp and tree houses, to me, seemed to like things that existed only on TV and yeah. weren't actually real. Yeah. <laughs> spider on your knee! Oh. What's the matter? You don't like spiders? I hate them. That's a surprise tool that can help us later. There's a guy named Zeke. He used to clean out the toilets here at camp. When he was in the army, he got his nose bit off by a parrot in the Philippines. Oh. One day, Zeke's outside digging a hole, and he hits a pipe, a gas pipe. He makes a big mistake and lights a match. Listen, I'm telling this story. He makes a big mistake and lights a match. <laughs> I like how the kids are taking a lot of enjoyment out of the supposed to be Wait, and scary. Uggs just chilling there with them? Yeah, he's in on it. I like how she grabbed the plunger by the business end. Like, oh, ew, yeah, Venus. Gross. And then Jesus. he looks in it. <laughs> yeah! And you two touched it. Now Zeke the plumber's gonna come and suck your brains out. What are you doing? Oh, well, I read that there's something in toothpaste that keeps ghosts away. This is the most ridiculous thing I've ever heard. I'm going to sleep. Fine. You believe what you want, and I'll believe what I want. You also didn't touch it, so it's already been established that you're less likely to be haunted. So it doesn't matter what you do. Have y'all ever slept in a bunk bed, top bunk? Um, yes, but there was no bottom bunk, so... I don't know if that really counts as a bunk yeah, bed. Yeah, because you could roll out and no, die. No, you're just on a very yeah. tall bed. Yeah, yeah. you get a bed on stilts. Did you ever fall out? No. No. It had 
uh, bars. Baby, baby guard. It had a baby. It had, dumb baby. <laughs> it had a baby. Me. Harry the hippo. Hey, where'd you get him from? From inside your head. That's where you keep all the things you don't want anybody to know about. That's what you're worried about. That's literally the the scariest thing you have in your head. Attention, everybody! Michael Stein sucks his thumb, and he has a stuffed animal at camp. Oh, he actually has it at camp with him. Oh no! How embarrassing, Michael. However, will you recover? You might as well go home now, and not a few episodes from now. <laughs> yeah. Oh no! He's gonna suck your face with his plunger. Ew. So when I first learned about Daleks, I think this. Oh, yeah. was, like, in my head also. That's interesting. Yeah, I hadn't thought about that connection. And there's another movie. There's a movie where, oh, like... <laughs> yeah. There is another movie. I've heard, legend, that there is another movie. <laughs> See you later, Harry. Aww. What a dick. You just sold out your homie. Boy, what's up? Zeke the plumber keep you up last night? No. No. They make camp look miserable, but then every shot you see is just people hanging around having a having, decent time. Saying. Yeah. Having a blast. Probably Ooh. the opposite of what summer camp actually is. It probably sucks. It really depends on the sitcom. Salute your shorts. All right. Mr. Belvedere, not so much. No. Wake me up. Look at all this undrank juice. Too pulpy. Probably no pulp in that shit. Good. Probably just tangy. D. Oh. That's fine. <laughs> Zeke. You didn't give her any time to fall asleep, Bobby. Nah, she's already asleep, dude. Damn, it's like, like me. Yeah. I'm Zeke the drummer. The drummer? <laughs> I'm Zeke the comer. <laughs> what I really want to do is play professional ball. Oh no! I can't possibly wow. get out of the way. Gave up no fight there either. I said I wanted to play ball, not go to a ball. This stuff is for sissy little girls who got nothing better to do with their lives. But you are a sissy little girl, aren't you? No. I like how this scene utilized a trope that would come up a lot in Salute Your Shorts. The weird three cuts. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. The door do, do, slamming do, do. three times. Yeah, they would do that a lot. It's supposed to, like, emphasize the anxiety they're experiencing. Yeah. I mean, it, it does an alright job. Yeah. Gets the job done for me. I like how he was doing his best um, Norman Fell impression by dancing with a plunger. Oh my god! <laughs> you have no idea how bad I wish the episode of Ropers we watched actually made for a decent episode, but, but it, it was gave bad, us nothing. Because the show sucks. Oh, is there a Ropers Halloween? <laughs> I, I, we should look! A very Ropers Halloween. Uh, god damn it, we <laughs> Get on the horn! I don't think you could stay out in that clearing where Zeke the plumber died for one night by herself. Is that supposed to scare me? Yeah. What is this? It's a bag of potato chips. I ask for ruffled potato chips. Hey, what's the difference? One has ruffles and the other one doesn't, you moron. You know, I was gonna sit out here with you, but now you can forget it. Oh, Bobby, you, you chase away everyone in your life. Fucking bulk and skull over here. <laughs> I heard you're planning to get Robert Butnick tonight. Yeah. Can I, yeah. Can I be a part of this? Oh, yeah! Yeah! yeah. Okay. I like how he just barges into kids' camp, like kids, yep. and doesn't knock or nope. anything. Guys, wait a minute. Can we trust Donkey Lips? I want to get Butnick just as much as you guys. All right, Donkey Lips, you're in. Okay. Cool. Okay, so. Fucking Judas? Yeah, yeah. I mean, to be fair. You want to teach your friends to be better people. Yeah, and Bobby ragged on him pretty hard there, so. Yeah, but I mean, ruffled chips don't have, you know, they either have ruffles or they don't. I mean, but I do got You got a good point there. I got to bring it up, though. Ruffles <laughs> are overrated and not nearly that worth a friendship. I don't know. I like them. Yeah. Oh, dude, that's cool. You sell me out for ruffles? Yeah. Is it? Oh. Well. Yeah. They are, yeah. They are pretty tasty. Want well, some if they have to, they have to come with some, like, French onion dip. Oh, Cause, hell yeah. Because ruffles French. are the best for the dips. You can't, exactly. You the, Ruffles are for dipping. You cannot use basic ass chips for dipping. Yeah, they'll just crack in half. Yep. So Donkey Lips eventually did like rap videos and stuff like that. No. Do you think he ever wore that pumpkin head? Probably not. As like a pumpkin wrapper I, I doubt throwback. Why well, is he wasting his potato chips? The, it's the like a trail. Military ass bag of potato chips. Yeah. 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 Giant chips. What is he doing? Fucking a rock. So we're getting some Home Alone style shit oh, here. He's oh, he's shaking up that's sodas. Right. What? All right. They're not gonna be like that for hours. 
He shook him for a solid two hours. So Danny Cooksey went on to be in Tiny Toons and a few uh, other things. He was in Silver Spoons before that. That's true. That's wrestling right. Reading a wrestling magazine. Yep. Uh, arguably the best thing he ever done. The character who played Donkey Lips was in a Super Bowl ad, I want to say, where they hooked a car battery up to him and he danced. Uh, there was also was an episode thing. of Singled Out that he appeared on for like a second. That's right. And as far as I know... Well, no, I forgot about Pinsky being in, in Rilo Kylie. Yeah. Damn it. Um, who's the who's the fat guy? Donkey Lips. Donkey, Donkey Lips? Lips? Michael, was it, what's his name? Michael Rilo? Bauer. Michael Bauer. Wow. He, he, was he, also, he was in fucking Evolution. Evolution is a mystery. I'm glad they all came back to report to the centralized area to be berated by Budnick specifically. You get your very own cute and cuddly Harry the Hippo to carry around. Even though you already dumped it in the trash and it was likely already collected. Sure are a lot of you guys out here tonight. Silence! And give me your head. How does he not know that's Ugg? Yeah, I mean, he sounded like Ugg the entire episode, yes. even in the other people's dreams. How many other people are that tall? Yeah, that's a good point. And what adult here hates you? <laughs> if there are any adults there's we no, knew, There's no other adults. It's either him or Dr. Dr. Khan. Dr. Khan, and we don't even see him. No, he's just a voice over a loudspeaker. Yeah. More like Bobby Dumb Dick. Oh, fuck. Got him. Burned him Swish. real bad. Toasted, roasted, and burnt to a crisp. Oh, fuck. Yeah, gum! You know, I knew you weren't a real ghost when you said I smell your fear. Really? Like, that's what tipped you off? Not the obvious voice? And the one throwaway comment? Ah! Ugh! But he's surprised. Who else could it have been? It wouldn't have been Donkey Lips. But I'm gonna need a knife to get you down. Yes, yes, you are, and you better get it fast. Go. You put yourself in the situation, Ugg. Yeah. How can you be You're mad at anyone? These kids. You're the worst camp person ever. Yeah. There is nothing in the world that I'm afraid of. One, two, three. Thank you. <laughs> Except spiders. <laughs> 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 Hey, you know something? These chips are pretty good without Ruffles. Yeah. No shit. Yeah, but you don't have dip with them, so... Ruffles ruin these. You know what I say. If a chip is delicious enough, you don't need dip. Oh, fuck off. I'll be your slave forever! Please, somebody help me! He walked into one spider web and, and completely... bitch. And completely crumpled. And even knowing what a jerk you are, we still came to the rescue. Why? Because you're my friends? No. Did y'all ever, ever go to camps? Have y'all ever slept in a bunk bed, top bunk? Did you ever reuse a Halloween costume for like more than one year? Ever gone mountain biking? What do you want to be when you grow up? What's the right tip? Can you remember the tallest man you've ever seen? 